and welcome back to another episode of Quantum Gaming. I'm your host, Shimbo, and hope you guys are going to enjoy the, enjoy the whatever time you're watching this morning, evening, night, who gives a shit. But anyways, so if, if you're watching this on Twitch when this was recorded, uh, this is attempt number two on getting this film, so yes. But anyways, we are... Back at it again with Spider-Man Remastered Part Two. Fucking get it. The last time we uh, ended this, we were uh, about to get shocked uh, by the shocker. We we're about to pull uh, a Hans Molenkamp or uh, whatever his name is, that chess player that had the accusation of uh, winning a chess tournament with a fucking vibrator up his asshole, and the, sh the shocks and the little vibrations like this would tell him which thing to move, like. But that's fucking crazy. Like, who would who would do that? Honestly, I, I it's such an out. It was such obviously it wasn't proven true, and he's that guy who was accused of that got brought back and was starting to do shit. But I just find that shit hilarious. But all right, let's not waste any time. Let's get back into this bad boy. Seriously. What is that? <laughs> I wanted to go straight. Wow, that's considerate. Get his ass. Okay, that that's such a great point launch to do. Why is that I feel like that's like a general option, but that's a horrible option. But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman. At least talk to me so we can make it interesting. Yeah, oh my god, I just had it, bro. Herman? What? The only answer to Shocker now? Mr. Shocker? Gotcha. Now let's talk. I said I don't Noted. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone. Or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or they can punch it out of you later. Your choice. Not enough. Move, move, move! Zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? Maybe later. That's rough, Brody. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, no, I wanted to. I think I'm going to kind of change suits like every couple things, not stick with anything consistent, really. This is going to be for the final. We got, we have to. It's the only suit, it's the only suit you got to roll with with that. This one, I don't know about that one. Raimi, the Spider-Verse, Stealth, Amazing Suit. Amazing suit's dope as shit, though. Like, 
Come on, bro. They need to have Tasm Tasm two suit in there. That one I prefer over one. All right, let's try this one again. I mean, okay, like I do kind of like this one a lot. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ, you're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. All right, Mr. Lee, let's get him. Let's get this son of a bitch. Let's get him. Oh, one thing I really wanted to talk about was uh, the new release of Counter-Strike 2. Um, people I know were playing it yesterday and they're fucking just losing their mind over it. It, it was the funniest stuff, but I, I, I think a lot of people who played CSGO from at least what I'm hearing is that they're just not a huge fan of of it. They just like it's not like they didn't change enough to make it like an actual sequel. So I'm like, well, we have a watch two, which is really just over one watch plus DLC. So it's just whatever. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? I mean, fair, fair point. All right. Interesting developments. Hey, the symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. No, that's well, bro straight captain. About as well as I straight hoped. captain. Okay, this suit does look clean. God damn, it looks clean. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little Spidey work out in the city. Uh, no, just give me missions, Brody. I'm just kidding. Oh, another thing I wanted to say uh, in regards was, uh, was, I don't, oh. of a narcotic sale in progress. We'll get to Mobilize that. But, but one of the things that, uh, I kept seeing was uh, Yuri, I believe. Uh, I think that's the guy guy's name. He talking about the what is it? Oh, he's talking about the the. 
the face change for Spider-Man. He said it's like, yeah, he said something along the lines like it's no big deal or something like it's not a huge issue. And I'm like, I mean, in in seeing, like obviously the new the face scan for this, it looks. I think it does look a lot better than uh the PS4 one. Oh my god. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. Here's your stuff. Only way we move them is you kill him. So that's just Bro, what? It didn't give me like two seconds. <sighs> Nothing puts a pep in my step like halting an illegal drug deal. Oh. Uh, but yeah, I mean. And then, like, sinks. Oh my god, every second, bro. There's always something like this. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I didn't forget, forget. I just. Uh, I'll be there soon. This tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. <sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time? I don't know, but I mean, I definitely do see what people mean in terms of the Spider-Man Two comments, like in the of like the battle damage uh, Peter Parker and the sequel game coming out. They're like, yeah, it looks like Tom Holland. I'm like kind of does it really does and I definitely can understand why people are you know are just like yeah they want to stray away from stray away from, oh my god hey May, like I was speak. saying don't worry about the story MJ's investigating I'll make sure she's careful please tell me you two are back together we're talking again baby steps I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee he's just concerned I was actually touched by how concerned I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Okay, as I was saying, like I get it, but I I, I just really prefer it. I I just the changes that they made. Attention were done for a reason and they are definitely working out and i i think now if they change the miles face scan i would probably have some issues but um overall like i i have no issues with these games other than the fact that god damn every five seconds someone's fucking chatting up spider-man no wonder i can get shit done bro i'm like in the middle of like a thought and it just keeps fucking with me All right, let's go cook some meth. I mean, uh, make some robots. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes. <laughs> hey. Hey. What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <sighs> Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. Thank you for your great service to our country. 
These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. Mmm. <laughs> I just... Oh, easy, easy, easy. There's no one gonna talk about how he walked out with the fucking arm. <laughs> he didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter. There's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. Oh no, what would he do? <laughs> Spider-Man starts in OnlyFans. <laughs> Bro, that's crazy. Imagine. Imagine. Ask him to talk to his dad. Yo, yo, what do you do? Norman never listens to What the hell? His new uh new picture is called Spider Booty? What? Must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. He's just gonna be like He's gonna have a camera like taped at this pole right here. He's like, just casually mind all my my own business or out here. You know, thickening up the city or some oh, shit like that. God, it's so Here's stupid. Harry's passion project. Harry left me a message about these before he left for Europe. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is, too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but it sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. Bro's mad guilt tripping him. No shot. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, um, what's the word, contaminants, before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. Mm. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high. And rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. This Part very is much is New York. <laughs> like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. For these clouds to be visible to the naked eye, the level of toxins must be up there. And gotcha! Getting some good stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff, anyway. <coughs> Got it. <coughs> oh. <coughs> Feels like I'm breathing from a tail. Huh. The toxins coming from two types of cars and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. Perfect. Light on that one. All right, let's get to it.
Best smokestack picture I ever took. Oh my god, that's a beautiful fucking picture. Take it from here. Maybe I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, Harry Station just stopped the public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Oh wow, now it's magically gone. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I did see a thing though about how like a truck or something was going up a skyscraper and wasn't damaging any of the Shocker has escaped and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was. But one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. What the fuck? Oh, yeah, but like, yeah, so like, for instance, a, like a thing was going against the, uh, like a car slamming against the uh, skyscraper shows like glass and shit falling down, but the da uh, buildings weren't damaged and everyone's like having a hoopla over, oh, if this was on Xbox, this would be like, oh my god, this would be crazy. I mean, Herman, not exactly long time all wrong. no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. <laughs> Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Want to play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa, your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You want to fight? Let's fight! Man. Can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid. You just stupid. You talk so much. Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not talking? Also, how would you measure? Words per minute? Syllables per second? Or is it more about how many words one uses to express a single thought? It's all so subjective. If you ask me, some people don't talk enough. Like about who their mysterious overlord is. The person they're working for, that kind of thing. Okay, now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I go, they'll kill me. I thought it moved out of the way. What the fuck? I pressed the button. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid. You so stupid. No. Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? Okay. And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not talking? Oh, okay. Now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I don't, they'll kill me. I pressed the button, bro. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm getting fucking wrecked. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid. You just stupid. You so much. Bro, I literally fucking rotate. What the fuck? Are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio? Now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? anymore you're lucky you found actual cash if you really want to rob banks try day trading it's all the rage wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. oh come on Herman 
You tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead. They made that very clear. Okay, so I did. Okay, the, I'm I'm just getting absolutely fucking touched. You tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. Do I talk? I'm Bro. Dead. They made that very clear. You're freaking me out, Herman. It's not like you to be afraid of people. I'm not even sure these guys are people. Could be anything under those masks. Wait, did you say masks? Oh my god, I can't move, bro. It's so locked down, I can't even see what the fuck's going on. Okay, last chance to give up. I, I, I get spawn killed now? I can't move, bro. I can't fucking move! Holy fuck. Oh my god. Okay, last chance to give up. This time I really mean it. Quit moving. There we go. Cameras. Okay, I was kidding before. Now okay. is your last last chance. Seriously. Sorry, Herman. You brought this on yourself. Literally. Damn. Man, he was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Oof. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on demon uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. I'll I bet the, the taxes are while. fucking Catch awful. Up on what I've been missing out in the city. The taxes are probably like the highest in the nation. <laughs> you want to live here? Guess what? Get ready to pay fucking 10, 10% or fucking... 10%, 8%, oh, 8% is now, I believe. Like, if you buy, like, a car or something. <laughs> probably New York, it's probably, like, fucking 12. Yeah, sorry, you buy a car, you have not, it's a 95% chance it's actually gonna get fucking crushed by a goddamn rhino. Work. 
Nice. Yeah, yeah, don't worry, I got him. I got him. Hey, so I looked into reports of demons. I knew you'd come around. They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. Are there any Fisk properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Thanks, Yuri. I'll check it out. Yeah, let's get him. Hey, Yuri. Any idea what Fisk uses that shipyard for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working in this case for years. If anyone mm. knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's him. Jefferson Davis, aka Miles Morales' dad. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup. That don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check. Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in. Eyes on. What caches are the demons after? Need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demons' hands. Snipers everywhere. I need to deal with them first. Hmm. No! Oh, gone. A lot of junk scattered around here. A well placed web shot could make a great distraction. Demons have been hitting other locations. That sniper has a guard watching him. May need to divide and conquer. Now let me focus. Make sure we didn't miss anything. They keep talking about gear. What does Fisk store here? that coming. Anyone's 
there. Sweet dreams. Gun check Echo hiding. One. I know you're here. No response from Echo One. Check on his position. Heading over to his last position now. Good night. What's that? Call me John Motherfucking Wick. You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Any place this rundown should have a hole in the wall or a broken window. Check around back. I know myself what you know. I'm Spider-Man. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Okay, where's that locked door? Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciated. You see a junction box powering the door? Yeah, got it. If we can overload it, that should force the door open. I've been working on electric webbing. This is the perfect field test. Sit tight. Remind me of my son. I started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Those guys love their hidden rooms. Check it out. Sound hollow to you? I got a hidden panel, like the one on the door. The conduits lead out the back. Look for another junction box. Let's see if my mask lenses can pick up the conduits. Did that work? Nah. Must not be the right box. Keep looking. Hmm. I 
got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room. There could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Uh -huh. They can hide the doors, but not the scrapes they leave. Keep an eye out for more of those. After scrapes, I should take another look around. Aha. Uh -huh. Pay dirt. Scrape, no door. None I can see anyway. Great. Be right there. Maybe not. Elevator's busted. Sit tight. I'll pull you up. Rusted machine parts, big honkin' rats. <laughs> Careful, the bridge is out. I got this one. <laughs> nice, stuck the landing and everything. We're not all <laughs> Fair enough. Another secret door. I'll rig the lock. Let me know if you find the junction box. Yep, on it. Did it open? No. This door must be hooked to another box. <laughs> Found one. Nailed it. Hell yeah, you did. Hey, check this out. Nothing. I'm starting to feel like this is Fisk's way of messing with me. But look at the walls. They kept guns here. They wouldn't have moved them to the front door. Gotta be a passageway we're missing. Check out the wall. This might control access to another area. Fisk's men were talking about a vault. Maybe we're close. Bet on it. Looks like a dual circuit. See if you can find a second junction box. Oh, so I did find it originally. It. Now it's just it's clear. Ready to go here. Right, Jeff. Trap door. Outstanding. Think you can help me out? This thing's heavy. One, two, three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. Got room to maneuver here. Hang on. What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. The place is unstable. Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. It sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Hurry! Bro, I was trying. Come on, let's go. Damn, demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an hallway. Or was. There, they blew the locks to get in. here hell no it'll take both of us to stop them and some of these they're moving let's go get them Just 
If I lose two trucks full of gunmen in one day, it's time to hang up the web. Anything crazy. Bystanders will get shot. I gotta get in close. Oh, now it lets me get on top of the car. Before, I was like right above them and it didn't give me shit. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know, the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. 
Okay. Up in. She's good. Interesting. Man, I'm beat. Time to head home and get some sleep. Sounds about right. I could use it. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's Route 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? Check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Let's Thanks, get Eddie. that shit. Municipal garage, Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. I don't care if you read everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30 ton garbage truck. I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. There's no way it's 30 tons. That's crazy. I can believe it though, but that seems crazy. Oh, of course it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. Hey, it's a long shot. But sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shop. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on. Wait, I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. Subway's that way. No sign of my stuff. <laughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, you're my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. We getting there spidey quick, bro. No, no time for backpacks. We gotta get our shit. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh oh, looks like trouble. Crazy. 
Thanks, Spider-Man. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. I think that's it. Please be here, please be As here. As a mask is literally just sitting there? Yes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> He's on Spider-Man, guys. Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look. An old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work. Look. It's that guy. It's Spider-Man. Uh-oh. Ice him! Oh, no. Your homie's... Yeah, yeah. Oh, your homie, like, bro, your 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 friends literally fucking like plaster to the fucking floor. He's on Spider Man. Okay. Well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. Let's see. Bro's gonna pull up and All she's right. making out with another dude or something. I'm gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch. Ah. Uh, hi, MJ. It's Peter. Any chance I could stay over to. Oh, that's too far. I was just in the neighborhood and oh, that's lame. Hey MJ, now that we're talking again, I thought maybe I, okay, that just sounds pathetic. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. Bro's just gonna stop at the fee center or some shit. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Huh, someone left me a voicemail. Number's blocked though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Oh god. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh oh. I think I know that voice. The Galicious. Big booty cat. Never mind, we're just gonna stop right there for Nah no, man, we got we got we got a big booty lady waiting for us. We gotta we gotta we gotta get their stat, you know, we gotta make sure she's alright, you know what I mean? Oh my god, that's so fucking weird. Oh. All right. What the fuck? When did they add that? Hello, Spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. The black cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. Nah, man. She's she just playing you. Yeah. What? Oh, shit. Oh, I see. I'm dumb. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? She wants me to find something. I need it there. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Interesting. She's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Hey, Yuri. You still have black cat suit and equipment in the evidence lockup, right? 
I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were going to meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter, I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. Interesting development. Called it. Still on, not like I played this game before and remember every single detail, but you know, gotta take a W when you can. You know what I mean? But. Hey, so this gang war between the demons and Fisk is really heating up. I know. Even Shocker's a part of it. Got roped into running jobs for the demons. These guys are serious. Do they just want to replace Fisk? That'd be bad enough. Hope it's not something worse. Probably oh, is. <sighs> Can't believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. Bro, probably smells like cat piss or some shit. My God, his what are you doing here so his sweat must be radioactive at this point. Like for Hope fuck's May's sake, couch but. is comfortable. I I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Bro is just asking for everyone what? to deep dive into Is his life busy? and like, what does he mean by that? Hey, bro, just, just straight up. Don't say such shit like that. Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Exactly. Now bro's like tweaking about it. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after? Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still, a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Want to join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. Bro, I was not ready for this. It's too soon. Too soon. But watch a homie <laughs> have a cannon. <laughs> We're about to watch homie have a cannon event. Oh my god. I haven't even seen... Uh, I haven't even seen the new uh, Spider Verse movie. Oh god, but bro, <laughs> dude, that's just that's funny as shit right now. But uh, yeah, bro, really is gonna have a cannon event. No, <clears throat> no, I'm not doing that fucking pigeon, goddamn uh, mission. We're keeping it strictly objective. Get someone killed. Officers, pull your wounded back. I'll handle this.
Dude, that, I just saw that blood splatter. That's crazy. Or, or I don't know what that was. Crazy. I think that's it. Everyone okay? Demons fight like men possessed. Bro has the craziest vertical. <laughs> There's more where these came from. So I noticed, I think it was on monthly games or it was on play, uh, PlayStation Plus, but NBA 2K23, knocking 24, 23 is uh, hey, a. God, every single time, bro. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons tells me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the Fisk construction site in Midtown. Life would kill me if I ditched a ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by, let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> no, but. So this is the thing that's still pissing me off and I'm like reason why I will never buy another NBA game again is because so I got the next gen version or the cross gen version for when uh, the Series X and all that stuff came out uh, for NBA 2K21 originally the you know the current like the Xbox one version came out for a while and then eventually uh, later on in the release cycle. Uh, the next gen version came out. That game was a lot of fun. I had a lot of bugs. Lost a shit ton of VC because my account got bugged. I had to create a new character. Grinded out that character. Got him pretty high. Uh, then just stopped playing the game because, you know, other games to play and, you know. But it's always, I always like, you know, if I have a character established in like a 2K game, I always like to re download the game eventually and go back to that character and just establish that. But because of these fucking 2K games, when you do my career, it relies on their servers. And if you're not fucking, you know, if they don't have their servers up, you can't connect and play my career. What do you know? For some odd reason, they shut down their 2K21 servers for next gen and overall. And you can't even play the fucking, the, like, one of the most important aspects of the game is now just done. So that game is, like, completely dead. The reviews for it now is shit. And I just think it's a horrible practice to do. But then again, it's it's 2K and overall NBA. They don't give a fuck. They know every year the same demographic, the same, you know, people that buy all their games and every year spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars on VC every single year when a new game drops. They don't give a fuck. And if it costs them less money and just in, up their profits, they'll, they don't give a shit. Yet, here we have Xbox acquiring Activision and fixing servers for old games. And, you know, now people are matchmaking great on Xbox Call, Call of Duty games from like 10 years ago plus. Like, that's crazy. Like, 2K could definitely afford to keep up some fucking servers for old stuff so people can actually play the games that they bought. Yeah, no one wants to play fucking my teams because, wait. I'm guessing you're going to need fucking online to do that. You can literally only do play now offline modes. It is atrocious that that even was allowed to happen, but it's probably in the terms of service, whatever that they have, you know, ultimate say or whatever. I will literally shit myself if I like redownload 2K22 and I realize that those servers are still up. It's like it had, like I would only, like, I'll be pissed if it's just for that game and other games previously still have their servers up. It had to be up. Like they had to probably what if they're gonna do that for 2k21 they had to do it for everything previously and just anything 2k21 and above will get now get support but i don't know that's why i'm like if i can get a game for get get a game like that for free that's the only way i'm gonna do it i'm I, I i'm not gonna spend another get because i think i got like the yeah i got like the most expensive edition like the mamba or the mamba edition yeah where you get both editions, the uh, current stand, current gen one, and then the uh, next gen one, with a uh, it was like Dame Lillard and then uh, Zion Williams for cover athletes. 
bro that pissed me that pissed me off so bad i was like why can i connect i literally restarted redownloaded the game and also i'm like no i'm just gonna check the check the forums yeah and people are pissed i'm like that yeah it, it, it's it's horrible horrible so that is exactly why i will never buy a fucking 2k game again because the game's not even that fucking old there's three games now down the line from that one and they shut the servers down that's crazy So that's why I redownload. That's why I downloaded 2K23 because it's free, and I, I you know, I want a basketball game, and I, it just, I mean, I'm one of those guys who just, if I buy the game, that's all I'm gonna buy. I don't need to buy fucking BC. I don't need to do that shit. It's not that deep. Just I just grind out my career to the uh, the camp the campaign basically. I don't ever fuck with the park because shit gets so toxic, and I'm just you know I'm here to be a casual player. You know what I mean? I'm pissed because I grind the fuck out of my career too. Like bad, bro. It's crazy. I have to explain it, but I once I got sh I think I like Oh, here. Let's get these cuts and I'll explain it. Consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. The boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. Yeah, so basically, like, every 2K game, I, like, grind the fuck out of it. And I, like, make sure in the first season I set all the records and shit. And I definitely... <laughs> I have to get a 100-point game. So I think the highest I got is like 152 points in a game. And that's, and that's like hitting like 20 something three pointers and shit like that. Like I, I, like I really do like their games and I have fun with it. I just don't like the aspect that, you know, like if they really gave a fuck about the games that they're making and like making it for fans, they would make they would literally make the games. <coughs> like I don't know why they 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 make my career like online only. Like what they should actually do is make it so if you want to play your my career character and do like you know the NBA season and shit. That's offline. That doesn't require the, their servers to be activated. But yeah, if you want to connect to the park and do the park, yeah, you gotta make the servers have to be up and do that. But they're never gonna do that. Cause then why buy another game? I mean, it's not like all all they're gonna do for like, cause all they fucking do year to year is to change how much more sweat a fucking person has. Like every so often do they actually like make like big changes? You know what I mean? Got what you came for. You don't need to kill us too. This Damn. territory is ours now. Not today. We are okay. Huh? You motherfucker! He never touches the ground. Hey, Willie. Nice jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Wow, that's nice. Saving bad guys from other bad guys. Not how I thought today would go.
got their attention. Like, out, like, they gotta, like, I mean, <sighs> my thing is, like, with EA and 2K, they, I just don't think they give too much of a shit, because they don't really have any other competition to make sure their game is truly the best out there and truly for fans, and I think that really hurts, um, the overall gaming experience for sports games. I mean, UFC... Five looks pretty good. Looks like they're finally making changes that they needed. And my thing is, I just feel like with sports games, and, e and this is even for Call of Duty, they they hold off on adding shit or whatever uh, because they know they're going to make a next game, and they know fans want a certain hey, feature, guy. so instead of adding it into the current game, which they definitely could fucking do, what they'll do is they'll just you know save it for another edition. And that's exactly what do you know they're doing for fucking Modern Warfare 3. They're doing exactly that. It, it, it just, it's really kind of annoying, like, and I, that's personally why I'm also not getting Modern Warfare 3, because, like, I just don't, it's just going to be like, it's, you know, it's kind of, a, Call of Duty is kind of a joke at this point. I mean, I, if anything, I'm going to play X Defiant and other stuff. I mean, I hate to do it. Like, I really want to play the campaign and stuff. But I'll probably just watch, like, a game movie or something. I know I streamed Modern Warfare 2 campaign and stuff like that, and I like streaming Warzone. But the old Warzone servers are now officially offline, and, I mean, it sucks. I was totally thinking about, you know, doing a video on that, like, doing Lost Rob. Outside, but I'm like, I've already a ton of content of the good old classic Warzone. Back when I loved it, uh, for all the bullshit in Caldera, cause fuck Caldera, Caldera was a fucking annoyance, just a cesspool of green. It, it's just like the, I mean, Verdance, people hated that shit when it came out, I did not mind it, I have my fondest memories doing a lot of, uh, payload or whatever it was, uh, plunder, okay? plunder. Uh, with me and my cousin just sit there, you know, farm leveling up our weapons and just be like, I would drop like 15 kills of the game, just pissing God, people off, fast. making people rage, and do that. And that's what I, that's what I liked about it. But, um, Caldera just did not have the same vibe, and just, there's just, everyone, the thing that I think really killed it for me is just always trying to figure out what the meta was, always trying to figure out, like, what's the best gun, everyone uses the same guns. So I, I'm just like, why get a loadout if I just wait for someone else to get their loadout? I'll get a gun that's you know just as good, if not better. Just kidding. There's no guns better than whatever the meta is. But I mean, there's it just. Yeah, there we go. Make sure we're not fucking dying here. You two stay here. Wait for the police. Yeah, I don't know. I just. If Call of Duty really wanted to do better, they could. They could just listen to fans, but I don't know. If anything, I would, I would go back and play Call of Duty if like they actually listen to fans and it's a shame. Plus, like, bro, they literally got Nicki Minaj in fucking the game now. Like, it's it's. And what happened to the vault weapon system? The only vault weapon systems I see are for the ones that came with the game and initial launch. So that's why I just am like, bro. They hype up something that they never even fucking did. Um, like the like the temper, whatever, the red thing for like the M4A1 and like the recon. Like, yeah, that's cool. And pretty much like, it's like if you didn't pre-order or get the ultimate edition, where the fuck, you, how you would get that, you just would not, you know, you, you won't have any vault system or any stuff like that. Unless I'm wrong, which most likely I probably am, but last time I checked, which was like, Last time I like seriously played was season one. I haven't played anything else. I've been kind. Of, I casually kind of play it, but I just it's it's so fucking tedious and boring. I pretty much played all season one, maxed out the you know the battle pass and everything because my pure bonus uh Your turn. Who runs the demons? made sense. Maybe he's there. Maybe he isn't. Check the roof. I've missed these cryptic fist talks. But it's just. Yeah, we'll get back to it after this shit. Hello again. 
again. That looks awfully like that mask that uh we gave to Martin Lee, you know what I'm saying? That just happened? Yeah. I'm getting reports of a helicopter with a wrecking ball? Yeah, things with the demons got complicated. Sit tight, Yuri. I got this. Please, let me have this. Oh, they're like whooping this. Okay, they're just fucking playing with me at this point. They're just flexing right now in front of the police station like, oh my god, that's crazy. That helicopter is destroying the city. I know. You need to bring it down. I know. Maybe you could superhero a little faster? Working on it, Yuri. Call you when it's done. Look at that fucking height, bro. Come on. Whoa! That was sick. Don't screw this up. Bro, I thought I said L1. I'm dumb. Just ruined the cutscene. You're welcome. I guess this is the plan. Yes, we we went back in time. We got we pulled up with Doctor Strange and everything. Come on, Pete, you got this. You got this, you got this, you got this!
<laughs> his eyes widening are just like I just watch a bunch of people get Please fucked up, bro. Up. These masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? Oh, cool, thanks. Do they have a website? Yes. Whoops. Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. Oh, crap. I'm late. You coming? Nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All oh, right, tell your pops I said congrats. MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are you? Got hung up at work. Be there soon. Let's get it. This episode is going to be very, very packed. I don't know. I think it's... I think this, the story for this game is pretty pretty long. Especially with everything to do in it. But my goal is just to kind of get this done as fast as possible. <laughs> just stick to the main story. Because we got to play this. we got to play Miles Morales. Then, you know, we got Spooky Season. So, you know, pull up with the... Might re-download Dreams on PlayStation. Uh, I forgot. Uh, fuck guy who put me on uh, dreams and uh, played their server it felt like a long time ago and now for listener emails May from Queens writes you're so full of anger and I wish you'd get help managing it it's terrible for your health now I know she speaks from a place of concern but this Dr. is a common misconception bro oh, thank you thank correct. you for hooking me up I'm you know what I mean I'm full of love I call out injustice, corruption, and crimes against humanity because... I don't know, I'm really hyped for the fucking Wolverine game. I, I just saw a teaser for it, and I just saw the blood on hands and then the claws. I'm, I'm fucking ready. I, they, they gotta, there's no way they're gonna make it, you know, like PG-13, kind of like this, you know. Just violent, you know, really good story, but they'll find a way. I mean, I want to be able to, like... I say, if you want to see the true brutality that this game should be, go watch, like, the cinematic, uh, from X-Men Wolverine when they're in a construction site. Bro literally stabs someone's head through a fucking wall, rips someone in half, I believe. Shit was fucking There's nuts. There's the stage entrance, and we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. Last time I gave a speech... I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. Well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> or maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Not honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so, so such exemplary citizens I think this gang war may finally be over. That, like, I would like, to hand like it over, to over? over? Um, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um. Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over. Uh, I'll cook. Or we could... You know, meet at a totally neutral location for a 
completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> For acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass, I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. Over there. Bitch, what the fuck you mean over there? Oh, are we gonna cross through here? Oh yeah, I totally knew that. Bro just had his cannon bent. Alright, Alyssa, I, I, I have to go find Dad, okay? No, wait. 
Miles, no. Miles, no! Dad's in here. I'll find him. Miles! Oh. Oh yeah, that was totally the obvious route. I'm just fucking blind. Baby. Helen Keller, who? It's alive. I know it. He was right there. Gotta find a way around these guys. Can't cross yet. I fucked up. No shit. Was right there. Gotta help him now. to leave now Dad. Dad.
I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were gonna say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Or don't worry. It's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry. I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. That was, uh, something. I'm sorry, Jeff. I'm busy. What's up? Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No. I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy. Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Hey, it's me. Hey, so what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up. And that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on me? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah. Good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked to the detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, MJ's hunch was right. Place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around. And this is where we're gonna have to end off for this uh, particular episode. Um, wow. Definitely a lot of different moments. I don't know what the fuck I'll make the thumbnail. I mean, there's like three different things I could think of for it. But, you know. I mean, this game's been out for a fucking long time, so I don't know if I want to do the whole rally or uh, do the helicopter shot where he's posed like this. I don't know. Either way it would work. Um, but yeah. I hope you guys are enjoying these episodes and uh, enjoying overall the story. The story is really good. I mean, obviously, I think after I stream kind of all these Spider-Man games, the next like main game I'm going to probably stream is Cyberpunk. That's a game I really want to do and just like show everyone like how great this game is and how awesome the story is. And even the side missions are awesome. I mean, they they have so much like emotion story in it. it it's 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 wild, and th this game, it, I I mean I know I'm playing Spider Man right now and I'm keep hyping up Cyberpunk, but bro, if you haven't played that game, play it. Yeah, you're gonna experience some dumb shit, dumb bugs, but fuck, especially after this update. Yeah, you're gonna be playing the game like it meant to be played at launch and it's gonna be awesome the combat the driving the vehicle com like all the stuff that's available now i didn't play or i didn't have when the game initially launched and i beat the game like a couple months later so if you're so if you're thinking about it as someone who has experienced all of the new amazing stuff that's been uh dropped and i love the game i can only imagine how much more you guys will love the game if you play at at this stage because i know i loved it when it was still going through all of its bullshit i mean after launch day i'd never really had any issues uh on xbox series x um overall i just think at this point in time like you 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 gotta you just you have to like there's no reason you know not to at all so you, you might as well you might as well but Without further ado, you guys have a good one.